Hey guys, we are going to be doing the Subtracting Integer Standard Algorithm Guided Notes. Our learning target for today is I can present integer operations with concrete models and connect the actions with the models to standard algorithms. So we have subtracted integers using the number line model and the chip model, and now we are going to wrap up that knowledge and connect it to the standard algorithm. This is basically the subtracting that you know. All right, so things we need to know. Subtraction is the inverse or opposite of addition. When we subtract integers, we're gonna change the subtraction problem to an addition problem. And when we do that, that is called the additive inverse. So to do that, we are going to keep the first number the same. We are going to change subtraction to addition. And then we are going to change the second number to its um, additive inverse, so its opposite. So for example, the opposite of 5 is negative 5. The opposite of negative 20 is 20. All right, let's do number one. All right, we are gonna keep negative 23. We are gonna change the subtraction to addition and then we are going to change negative 37 to its opposite, which is positive 37. So we are gonna use our addition integer rules. So I see that we have different signs, so I'm going to subtract. And then I'm gonna take the sign of the greater absolute value, which is positive 37. So my answer is going to be positive. So I'm going to do 37 minus 23, which is 14. And then my sign is going to be positive, so it stays 14. All right, number two. I'm going to keep the negative 21, change the subtraction to positive to addition, sorry, and then change the negative 87 to positive 87. I have different signs, so I'm going to subtract. And then I'm going to take the sign, my answer for the largest absolute value, which is positive 87, so I want my answer to be positive. So I'm going to do 87 minus 21, which is 66, so my answer is positive 66. All right, number three, 45, so keep, change to addition, and change to positive 13. I have same sign, so I'm going to add And my sign is positive, so my answer is going to be positive. So 45 plus 13 is 58. All right, number four, I'm going to keep a negative 78, change subtraction to addition. And then this one's a little bit different. I'm going to change it from positive 43 to negative 43. So I have same sign, so I'm going to add. But in this case, my same sign is negative. So I'm going to take the, I'm going to have my answer is negative because the greater absolute value is negative. So I'm going to do 78 plus 43 
and my answer is going to be negative 121. All right, number five, negative 90 minus 56. I'm going to keep negative 90, change subtraction to addition, and then change my positive 56 to negative 56. So I have same sign. So I'm going to add, and my signs are negative, so my answer is going to be negative. So I'm going to do 90 plus 56, and that's 146, and then it's a negative 146. Okay, number six, I'm going to keep negative 10, change subtraction to addition, and then change positive 54 to negative 54. I have same sign, so I'm going to add, and my answer is going to be negative. So 10 plus 54 is 64, and then it's negative. All right, number seven, I'm going to keep the positive seven, change the subtraction to addition, change my negative 18 to positive 18. I have same sign, so I'm going to add them, and my answer is going to be positive. So positive 25. Cal looks like a 26. Let me fix it. <laughs> it's supposed to be 25. All right, number eight. Keep the positive five, change subtraction to addition, change my positive. 43 to negative 43. I have different signs, so I'm going to subtract this time and take the sign of the larger absolute value, which is 43. So my sign is going to be negative. So I'm going to subtract them. 43 minus 5 is 38. And that's a negative 38. All right, we're going to do some word problems. Number nine says Jaden has $65 in his bank account. So this is a positive $65. Without thinking, he withdrew. Withdrew means to take out $100. So that's a negative $100. How much money is in Jaden's bank account? All right, so we can do positive 65 he took out $100. We are going to keep change, change. Different signs mean we are going to subtract and take the sign of the larger absolute value. So that is negative. So 100 minus 65. So his bank account is negative $35. Number 10, Titan is a dachshund that weighs, I need to fix my typo, weighs 18 pounds. The vet recommended that he lose five pounds through exercise and less treats. What is his goal weight? So he weighs 18 pounds. He needs to lose 5 pounds. Now we could just do this as 13 pounds. 
and not do the keep change change. But if I were to do the keep change change, keep change change, different signs mean subtraction. So 18 minus 5 is 13. The sign of the larger absolute value was positive. So I'd still get 13 pounds. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks, guys.